Hey guys, I'm CJ. Welcome to the channel. So today I was going to be sharing with you my Sephora VIB sale haul, but I ended up doing two separate purchases. So I originally was going to just do one purchase. It was going to be my just one thing. It was going to be just this. But then I ended up getting another $100 Sephora rewards gift card thing. So I went ahead and did a second purchase since it was during the sale. Not that I get to use the gift card in the sale, but it just happened that I wanted to just use it. I had it, I wanted to use it, and I figured I would just group it all into one Sephora sale. Actually, truthfully speaking, neither of these purchases that I make really fall into the sale category because I didn't get a discount on either of those. Both times I used a gift card and then my credit card. So this time I used, on this purchase, I used a $100 gift card and really that was my discount, if you will, and then I paid the rest of the balance. And then the second time, my purchase pretty much was just entirely the gift card. So. I'm calling it my Sephora sale haul, but it really was just kind of a Sephora haul. But anyways, if you enjoy my Sephora recommendation videos, if you enjoy my Sephora hauls, I'm not going to be doing very many of them because I'm quite over Sephora at this point. I'm sick of their whole rewards program. I'm sick of the whole gift card not being able to use it with a discount. I am just over Sephora and really not into a lot of Sephora products right now. So, but if you guys want to see it, you need to let me know because I'm going to stop doing Sephora hauls basically. So. Let me know in the comments down below. Of course, don't forget to comment down below, rate this video, subscribe to the channel if you've not yet done it, and let's just get on into my first haul. I was going to wait for the second part of this haul, but it's not coming till Monday or tomorrow or I don't know when, so I wanted to just get this up because I've already waited a long time. So let's just get into it. I purchased this, I think, on the very first day of the sale. So I mentioned this product in my Sephora recommendation video, and this is quite an expensive product, but it was the one that I really, really wanted. So I ended up purchasing the Atelier Cologne Luxury Advent Calendar. So this was $350. Look how freaking beautiful it is though, you guys. So, so pretty. I think I have it upside down, I do. So it's so pretty. This looks like the Liberty London Edmund color to me a little bit. Really, really beautiful. So we're going to crack into that in a minute. This was $350, but I believe it had upwards of a $475 value. And I have really been having a moment with the Atelier Colognes. I think I told you guys, or maybe I haven't posted this one yet. I have another kind of Sephora random haul video, but I wanted to wait until after this madness was over with. But I purchased an Atelier Cologne recently. I smelled the Atelier Colognes a few times now and I went to their brick and mortar store in San Francisco and it's so beautiful. I was obsessed with the store. And I love the fragrances. I think that they have some of the best fragrances on the market right now or at least some of the best ones you could buy at Sephora. So I've really been having a moment. I purchased Clementine California a couple weeks ago and I have literally not stopped wearing it. It's just this beautiful, fresh, citrusy scent. I love it. So because I've just been obsessed with the Atelier fragrances, I really was eyeing this luxury admin calendar. Now they had a couple different options. Of course they have the sample sets, they have the rollerball sets, and they have I think another advent calendar that's quite a bit less than this. But this one was such a good value and it had a lot of things that I wanted and wanted to try. So I went ahead and picked it up. Now if you were VIB Rouge, you of course would be getting 20% off of this. So you would be saving $70, that'd be a great deal. So $70 off, you would be picking this up for $280. I ended up getting it for $250 because I did have that $100 Sephora rewards card. So that was basically my discount. It was over 20%, so it all weighed up. So this has everything shown on the back, and I'm actually going to go ahead and not treat this like an advent calendar. Originally I was just going to haul this and then open it in a later video, but I'm going to go ahead and just open this up and let you see everything. So here's what the front looks like. It's blue, has this cute little bow on it, and it is an actual advent calendar on the inside. So of course I do know what's in here but you guys may not. So here's what the inside look like. looks like. It's beautiful. And on the side, it kind of talks about Atelier Cologne, and it just really just talks about their brand. It was established in 2009 and was originally founded in Paris. This little advent calendar, you get to kind of layer your fragrances. You get shower gels, body soaps, lotions, little atomizers, and cute little hand cases. So one thing I really, really liked about this is you do get 
to kind of work on layering fragrances so you get the actual colognes and then you get hand creams, body lotions, some soaps, and it's just a really, really nice set if you enjoy the cologne, the Atelier colognes, if you want to kind of adventure with other fragrances. This basically gives you a gift set, full-size fragrances, and some other body products all in one thing. And it was so beautiful that I thought it was a great price. If you guys want me to want me to open all of the little drawers and just show you those individually, let me know in the comments down below and I can do that. And if not, that's part one of my Sephora VIB haul. Stay tuned for part two. It'll be pretty quick as well. There was only two products in there. So that's all for this video, guys, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye, guys.